Hey, I'm Emily from Get Offset, and I'm finally back with another video of my Squire Starcaster. This has gone through a few iterations. Uh, the first video I had of it was just completely stock, right out of the box, very new instrument. And this is, uh, I think, the third video I'm doing. So the second video I got with my friend Sean from Gun Street Wiring, and we just did a general upgrade of the wiring. So I think the big difference there was switching to 200, uh, from 250 to 500 uh, pots in the tone, which I thought gave it a much better, fuller sound. And it's a way more affordable mod than buying new pickups, which is really expensive, though often worth it. Uh, so when I talked to Sean, we had always agreed that I would do two videos. I just wanted a simple upgrade and I wanted to do something wild. And the wildest thing he does is what he calls the black dog wiring harness. It's great for two humbucker guitars. And there's a lot going on. So much so that I, uh, I took notes. I took notes to, so that I would know what was what. So depending on the position, these pots push and pull to do different things. And each one does something different depending on the position. So we're gonna start here what's called the treble position of the neck. I'm gonna turn up some room sound. I'm using the Strymon Iridium. I'm using the round B setting, which is my favorite. And uh, let's start with the bridge volume. The bridge volume, right there, simple coil cut. That's the bridge volume. That's not the bridge volume, this is the bridge volume. Oh my. So we're gonna turn up the bridge volume. Let's sear it as a zinc coil. we are going to pull the bridge tone, which is a phasing switch. So that changes, um, just puts out a phase. It means the ground is now hot and the hottest ground is the general idea I get of it. So in phase. Apparently the neck tone is like kill switch. Neat. Uh, so next we're going to. I'm just going to go to the neck pickup. So the neck volume, just like the bridge volume, is a quail cut. Then the uh, tone pot is a parallel. So instead of having two, uh, instead of having a humbucker, you have two single coils that run in parallel. And then you can com 
combine that by also cutting the coil. Somehow, I don't understand how that works. All right, so neck has um, a, just two things really going on with it. And then the middle position has the most stuff. So um, the volumes for each one are just a coil cut. So you can have a neck single coil or an abridged humbucker. Or you could have it the other way around. You could have both single coils. And that sound compared to uh, two humbuckers. This happens to me a lot. I think more the fault of the pots than either myself or the wiring. So let's just slap that back on there. I have another guitar that I have um, put Sugru on in, in the little knobby things here when they uh, don't fit right. And I worked with Sean. I know that this should be the correct uh, size pots for these knobs, but somehow it just doesn't quite work. So next is the uh, bridge, and that goes back to that phasing. So there we're in phase. That was out of it. And then we have the parallel thing going on with the neck tone knob again. That's parallel and that's this, this is standard. So that's everything. I'm going to crank up the gain here a bit and see how that sounds. coils in here. single coils.
that single coil. is the black dog wiring harness from Gun Street Wiring. Hit Sean up and tell him I sent you. He's a great human and he has helped me a lot. Wiring these guys up, not always so easy, especially with the uh, F-holes here. Um, but whether you're new to soldering and wiring or a pro at it, he makes it so easy. He's very available to help and troubleshoot, and I cannot recommend his work enough. Uh, he is a gem, and I think y'all should support him. And you know what? He didn't pay me to do any of this. So I bought this wiring harness myself, and I installed it and had him help, and I'm very happy with it. So check them out. I really love gun Street wiring and this wiring harness. Uh, and it enables me to basically have multiple guitars in the same guitar, which is so important. Uh, for shows when shows come back. Thank you. Uh, like, subscribe, and uh, leave a comment, if you will. Uh, thanks so much, and have a great rest of your day.